as Bendorf will fling it around. Now Belvacqua will try to pinch, and that's successful, holding it in. Sends it and scores! Wow. Odd angle goal. The Tigers could not get it out of the zone. And that's number five, Michael Belvacqua, with his fifth of the season. It's 1-0 Lakers. Well, you called it, Gino. They couldn't clear it, and you saw Mercyhurst pinch in. The forecheck comes into play, keeps the puck in the zone. That's just a great play, picks it. And then you're right about an odd angle. Choppy. Out. You're playing, you're not playing. Then you get a game, and then you get extended time off. So really been tough on the players. Sheriff dumping it off. Shot oh. goal. That's Bendorf from Sheriff, and it's 2-0 Lakers on that break. Willett holds it in. Now Willett's double teamed on the wall. Willett sending it down low. Calverly in front. Yes. It's in. Yes, the Tigers get the goal. John Will Calverly, he is the goal scorer for this team, seventh of the season. So the Tigers for 126 are only going to have three defenders on the ice. Oh. But then knocking it out. And here's a breakaway. Will Calverly going in. Calverly. Deeks and yes. scores. It's a shorty. A five on three shorty. And we are tied at two. Ho oh. ho. McDougal sending it back. 20 seconds remaining. At the point, shot off a of body in front. Barry with the block. Briere on the far side. 12 seconds remaining in the five on three. I can only imagine what the corner crew will be doing right now if the Tigers can kill off this five on three and get a short-handed goal in the interim. Shot, save made by Drakken. Rebound, yep. and they score. Just as the penalty expired, that's number 12, Austin Heideman, and it's 3-2 Mercyhurst. Now Townsend lifting it out. No, he can't get it out. Zoskowski pushing it back down. Dupuy on the back side. Instead, Bruce crashing down low. Yes. Wide open is Dupuy. And the Tigers have tied it on three on the power play goal by Alden Dupuy. Boy, everybody with their head up looking to make that pass. Just precision passing there by the Tigers and able to finish. Shot by Spagnolo goes through McDougal. Feet in front. Good save by oh. Drackett, but then the rebound pushed back in. And Mercyhurst retakes the lead. It's 4-3. to three. Caleb Moritz to take the draw. He's flanked by Hamaker and Gonzalez. Tigers win the draw. Shot by Willick. Goes through the rebound by yes. Gonzalez. It's in. Elijah Gonzalez picking up that rebound. Gonzalez is six of the year. We're tied at four. Look like that puck crossed up Johnson. Went high off his pads, and then they looking for the puck. Here comes a shot way from outside. Looked like it hit off his chest or mask, and then able to and Gonzalez right there for the putback as he gets knocked to the ice. Now you're talking. Joffe on the far side will lift it out of the zone. McDougal now will chase after for Mercyhurst. Calverly right there trying to create the turnover. He does. Yes, it Here's Bruce going in. Falls down. Bruce getting back up. A two on none. And still, somehow, <laughs> the Tigers score. Sean, what happened? <laughs> They get, they get the turnover. Bruce just loses his footing, but he's able to keep the puck <laughs> on his stick, and he gives it to number eight, Will Calverly. That's unbelievable, Gino. Wow, what uh, what a hat trick yeah. here. There's the giveaway. Just a uh, terrible giveaway. <laughs> where, where is the defense? Nobody back for the Lakers. If I'm Rick Gawkin, I'm like, what? you got to at least get back. Well, what Ari Kfee could use is the next whistle here. But, no, oh, here's Hamaker behind the defense. Hamaker going in, the backhand, and a penalty coming up. The question is, it's a penalty shot. Yes. A penalty shot coming up for Jake Hamaker. Here's Hamaker going in. Hamaker to make this a two-goal game. He does. Jake Hamaker, 6-4 RIT. Boy, lined him up. Thought he was going to go to the stick side. Like we've seen on the breakaways, it looked like it crossed up Johnson. Like where he releases, sometimes we see players get in too deep. All right, they're coming all different ways tonight for the Tigers, John. A shorthanded goal, two power play goals, and even strength. And there, the penalty shot goal by Jake Hamaker. RIT battling back from a 2-0 hole to win this game. What a nice win for the RIT Tigers. Hadn't played in three weeks, fell behind two zip, playing a hot Lakers team unbeaten in their last four. They got off to a slow start and then dominated the ice the rest of the way. That's a good, solid win for Wayne Wilson's team.